is an artifact scatter. Right. And I have a sort of designation I use for that on in this GPS. Okay. So you just punch in the coordinates or something? Yeah, well, so, so on, um, this gives it a unique number that's right. just easy for me to keep track of. 463 is the compartment. Uh, one designates the locus I'm in, which okay. is a particular sort of archaeological feature. Right. And then uh, ASI is just artifact single, which is I'm collecting this single artifact okay. scatter right over here. And then I'll, I'll record the points and get the GPS coordinates from that and know exactly sort of spatially where it comes from. Okay. And I'll mark it on the map I've been making as well. So. so we are here in this property which is next to the solar super mayor. And uh, we seem to think that this is a structure that goes back to the old city or at least as old as the 1500s. And we are on the lookout for artifacts. So you must be having a room full of them by now. I do. Have, I have bags and bags that I have to analyze during the monsoon. And you'll send it by cargo to to back home, or what will happen? Um, or if you go no, to the well, I'll do all the analysis here. Okay. Uh, and I'm just doing the preliminary washing and sorting, and I'll draw. Uh, any of the diagnostic pieces, which include uh, bases and rims and things like this, where you can understand the shapes of the ceramics and things like okay. this. Okay. So, uh, I'm just doing the initial. I have met one woman who's doing uh, some, uh, uh, let's say, chemical analysis of ceramics. Right. Uh, in particular, she's interested in Portuguese faience. And so I'm probably going to send her some sherds, assuming ASI mm. lets me, which I, they won't, shouldn't have a problem with, yeah. to actually do sourcing. This is in Lisbon, is it? This is in Lisbon, yeah. She's yeah. a Portuguese. What's her name? Um, I just met her on Facebook. Okay, actually. okay, right, right, right. Yeah. I'm wondering if I know her already. Yeah, uh, yeah and she's, she's really interested in the Portuguese production, and so she's sourcing ceramics from their major centers of production, which were Lisbon, Coimbra... Uh, and a couple other cities. Okay. Uh, and she was in Goa recently, was she? She wasn't in Goa, no. Uh, okay. Uh, I don't think so. Okay, okay. She, she might have been. She knows Rokini from the ASI and, and knows some of the other people I do. But she's she's interested in, in sort of the distribution of these ceramics worldwide. Okay. So she's very interested in what I'm doing.